10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, top Allumage de ZSR, décollage Director, thank you so much for uh, joining us. How does it feel today, the success? I mean, this is incredible. With Ariane 6, uh, now we are regaining access to space. Uh, satellites are used for everyday life, uh, for weather forecasting, navigation, telecommunication, uh, Earth observation, many things uh, where people depend daily from uh, data or information from the satellites. Ariane 6 is necessary to launch these satellites. And I'm so happy, I'm so relieved uh, to see the rocket now uh, up in the sky and uh, really having a big success. I am so happy. What are the next steps for Ariane 6? The next steps, uh, of, course, of course, Ariane 6, we need to ramp up. Uh, we need to uh, make sure that uh, we have many, many launches. And this is something that uh, we are working on. So there's a very clear plan. But also we would like to make it even cheaper, uh, even more versatile, and uh, make sure that we are, of course, ready for the future. In parallel to Ariane 6, so we are uh, starting a completely new way of uh, how launches should be uh, defined in the future with uh, what we call a launcher challenge, where we as ESA will be the customer of uh, private companies developing their own launcher, a bit like what the US is doing uh, and has been doing with uh, uh, SpaceX, uh, the, it's called the COPS program. Mm -hmm. And based on this, SpaceX has developed and uh, you we would like to use the same scheme. Of course, SpaceX is quite unique, but uh, in terms of model, we would like as ESA, like NASA, as ESA to be the anchor customer to allow private industry to really develop a very competitive launcher. Thank you. And uh, what are your priority for the challenges of Ariane 6 uh, over the next few years? I mean, there is a lot of challenges uh, always, but it's really re-establishing access to space. Ariane 6, the bigger C, uh, the Alien Ladder, Rock and the Medium Weight Class, uh, new launchers, the micro launchers uh, that are coming now to the launch pad, the first one maybe this year. Uh, and this will really generate a completely new ecosystem of launches. That means Europe will have much more versatile launches, many different ones to choose from. And that's good because you have more launches, you have more competition, therefore the prices uh, go down. And this is something that we really would like to foster. So yes, the future will be being more agile, cheaper, uh, but also environmentally sustainable. We work a lot on, our, on the greening of the site here. You see here Kuru, which is uh, a very beautiful site, but we really invest a lot that by the end of this decade, we will have 90% reduction of the carbon footprint, uh, which is quite enormous. So we're investing really money with hot water dikes uh, uh, to, uh, to really make sure that we are also sustainable. And uh, of course, in addition, launching our satellites. So. Wonderful. And uh, one last question. Uh, why it is uh, so important that people choose Ariane 6? Well, Ariane 6 is a wonderful launcher. It will guarantee access to space. Uh, but let me also say that uh, sometimes I hear that people are a little critical of Ariane 6 uh, to be later than originally planned. Uh, it does not uh, allow reusability like Falcon 9. Uh, it is uh, certainly a launcher that is fit for the European purpose, for the European market. But let me also say that we are working in parallel on the reusability. We are having a, an engine called Prometheus, uh, which will become a future a reusable engine on a future reusable launcher. So yes, we are working in the same direction. We put a lot of energy into it. Uh, we have very good engineers, we have excellent uh, people working on the launcher sector in space in general. And yes, I would like to make sure, as like the general of ESA, that uh, Europe is on top of it, that Europe is really competitive and has a, a good space ecosystem, launchers, satellites, uh, data, services that are being used from it, that this is what we need to do. Thank you so much, and again, congratulations on this fantastic day. Thank you so much. We are all very happy.